sinner. Your mother and I slept on it. And as punishment for wrecking my car, you're going to get a job to pay us back for the repairs. What am I supposed to work? I have a rehearsal for the new school musical like every night. Well, you're going to have to quit the musical then. We gave you an opportunity to be responsible, and you blew it. Mm -hmm. Every weekend, you're here in your room. But... Okay. It was me. I was the one who crashed the car. What? And me. Don't hate me, Mom and Dad. Taylor was just covering for me. Is that true? You did that for him. Yeah, of course. He's my brother. <gasps> I'm proud of you. Are you crazy? What were you thinking? You're not even allowed to drive. Cooper and I snuck out to meet some girls at a party. We forgot to put the car in park. It rolled down a hill and it crashed into a tree. I don't even know what to say. That's never happened before. I'm sorry. It's just you guys always call me the sensible kid. So you're mad because we think highly of you? I wanted to do something reckless, and it turned out a little more reckless than I wanted. He was actually a very safe driver. Ten and two the whole way. Wasn't too chatty. Would have been nice if there was a chilled Evian in the back. Let's go from the top. You and Cooper sneak out. Grounded for a month. Drive my car. No phones for six months. Without a license. Most kids take their driver's test at 16, not you. You're gonna be the weird spandex bike guy until you're 21. And I'm buying you the shorts, and you're wearing the shorts. I think the biggest issue here is the damage to the car. And for that, I'd like to no. pay... To pay us back for the repairs, you're getting a job. A minimum wage job. I want you to pay us back nice and slow. We also lied to your face. No punishment for that? What are you doing, man?